there once was a Gratian yacht party en route to Miami for a Tweedy. They came across a treasure chest and inside was Todd Sorsen. Oh, when the Meast Man comes, when your opponent sees him, he'll need some tums. Oh, when the Meast Man comes, he's gonna split BK's nuts in half. Everyone can crack the nuts. What is this card? Goyaye ovo carta. Goyaye ovo carta. Volim Duncan. Listen, boys, don't let anyone ever tell you that you don't learn anything on the channel. We learn languages out here. What's up, boys, and welcome to the Mad Lad Team of the Season Mislav Orsic episode featuring the Inter Miami Blizma Tweety, the MLS Team of the Season, and the rest of the World Team of the Season that just dropped today. Have some pretty ridiculous looking cards. No upgrade packs really to speak of at all. I feel like, uh,. Again, uh, I, I said it yesterday, wasn't really expecting a whole lot from today's content. Again, you know, for us that we, you know, kind of like these off-nation, uh, off-league, uh, off-league players like the DACA, uh, like the, uh, like the Rui Diaz, as well as some of the others, mainly this, uh, Blaismo Tweedy, who, uh, we're gonna get into right away and just give you my thoughts just because he is my homegrown talent, he's my hometown hero right here. Let's keep it a stack, uh, did not deserve one based on performance, but we will take it because he's an Inter-Miami player and we obviously represent Inter-Miami. Uh, upgraded to three-star, three-star, and like I said, looks like an end-level card, uh, looks like an end-game card, uh, in terms of linkability, French, so I mean, like, literally, there's a million French players, he's probably gonna make it into our weekend league run next weekend, I've got myself Bamba, uh, I'm gonna lock myself the Awar, we have, uh, Benzo, we have Giroud, and then we've got a couple other boys, um, on the RTG, we're gonna run a full French squad, maybe even Petit, um, actually, he's probably the Petit replacement, to be honest with you, but a very, very cool-looking card, is it the most exciting card? No, but a very, very solid-looking, uh, CDM, if you're, uh, if you're looking to, uh, put together some some sort of French squad, but I should say very, very much a solid player. Today, it is all about the summer vibes. I don't know about you, wherever you guys are. I know it's really hot in the UK right now. Here in Miami, it's absolutely, uh, it's about to be boiling as well. Uh, and I thought there's nothing other, there's nothing quite like a Croatian squad during summer vibes uh, that just uh, ushers in, uh, that ushers in the summer. And today we're looking at Mad, uh, Mad Lad Mislav Orsic, the Croatian Dynamo himself, placed for Dynamo Zagreb. Three-star skill moves, four-star weak foot. Would have been nice to get himself a skill move, but today it is all about this Mislav Orsic, aka the super sub a guy that we have featured on the channel countless times uh, over the years, and uh, today we're going to look at his 90 rest of the world team of the season card. But if you guys do enjoy, smash like on the video. If you guys like an episode here with a creation, smash like on the video. If you yourself are creation, smash like on the video. If you guys love the kit, hit that subscribe button and uh, smash like on the video as well. But today it's all about 90, like I said, Mislav Orsic gets himself the three-star skill moves, four-star weak foot. Would have been nice if EA gave him maybe a five-star weak foot or even gave him a three-star skill moves because he does have that lean body type and he can move like an absolute silky game boy. 98 acceleration with 99 sprint speed. 94 finishing with 96 shot power, has 95 long shots, 99 agility, reactions, 87 ball control at this stage in the game for a card that has those ridiculous dribbling stats. We're going to get that jacked off with the marksman up to 96, dribbling goes up to 99, and composure goes up to 91, has 90 strength uh, with the marksman chem style, and then already has the 99 stamina with, in my opinion, the best, uh, with the best uh, uh, trait in the game, the finesse shot trait. And like I said, we're going to be running a full creation side, Davor Sukur, right striker, Mislav Orsic, left striker, we're going to have this guy. Uh, we're going to have this guy Petkovic, uh, four star, four star. We need to give ourselves a little bit of a handicap in order to uh, in order to give our opponents a chance, given that we have the Mislav Orsic. And then running the midfield will be Modric and the uh, Modric, and then also the Ivan Perisic, who we uh, who we didn't get a chance to use when his foot birthday came out, and we also uh, didn't get a chance to use the we didn't get a chance to use the uh, the Luka Modric card. But let's get into a couple matches here with the Croatian Mad Lads. We're going to be playing a lot of Stereo Love. Match number one with Mislav, team of the season Orsic, maybe. The best super sub in all of FIFA. 250,000 coins is what he's going for. Match number one, Kravatska. Ivan Perisic. Davor Sukar. Right, what's the sprint speed looking like? Now that I'm thinking about it, I'm actually really upset that he didn't get the four-star skill move upgrade. I mean, like, what, what do we have? A, a few months to go before the, before the new game comes out? By the way, Luka Modric is absolutely insane in this game. There's the Mislav Orsic. 
That's the Mislav Orsic body faint to the finesse. He's got that really beautiful little hair type. Uh, he trimmed. He he, cl he cleaned up the trim for the summer on the on the yacht party to press to press the gals. Mislav Orsic picking up where he's left off in pretty much epi every epi that we've ever done on him. Do you see the strength? Goal. Fuego. Bro, aren't they rabbit to the right place at the right time? What is going on, FIFA? I don't know. The fact that Mislav Orsic, you know, the fa and Daka, the the uh, the Red Bull uh, Leipzig player from the uh, Österreich Bundesliga, just kind of represents that. Like, I think ER just missing the mark a little bit uh, in terms of the player selection. I think we definitely needed some upgrade packs today, but um, there's just things in Team of the Season that just seem a little bit off. Like, give uh, right. So if like Matuidi gets three star, three star, you know, give um. Give, give me Slav Orsic, uh, and I know it's not the, the base of the promo, right? Like, they don't want to give everyone these, like, upgrades because that takes away from, like, Shapeshifters and, and Foot Birthday, where, like, those are the promos where you get all the little crazy adjustments, right? But, um, I mean, we're, boys, we're in freaking, we're, all, we're in June. We're, like, it's basically, it's basically August. No paran de correr, metiendo fuerte, gana la pelota de nuevo. A ver qué hace ahora con la que tiene. The weak foot is, uh, well, actually he's got a four-star weak foot, so actually, I love how the Croatian players each have a different color boot. Modric and Perisic in the midfield both have red. Uh, we've got ourselves, who is that? Ante Rebic has himself the, uh, has himself the yellow. I feel like, I'm, I feel like I'm using Croatian Power Rangers. That's how you do it. That's how you do it, ladies and gentlemen. And he's got, is he gone again? Look at the attack positioning. And then look at the skill move. Fits it in there to the 46. That's a red card. Get him off the pitch. Another super voice. Come on. Davor Sukur in the dying embers of the game. Ravatska. That's why you make sure you have a Croatian manager in your squad so Slavin Bilic can do the run-up when you score a goal in the dying minutes and the uh, the next gen animation comes where the uh, the next gen the next gen animation happens where the stadium goes wild. So I think we got three goals from uh, Mislav Orsic in this one, no? We get three goals from Mislav Orsic. Um Mislav Orsic, AK Tom Syndicate, um, is, uh, so, dude, li literally lays it all on the line. Lays it all on the line for the lads. Um, very, very, uh, I, I wouldn't exactly say slippery. Again, he's kind of a guy, I mean, this was a nice, that was a nice little finesse shot. I mean, that's peak Mislav Orsic using the uh, finesse shot. Uh, and then that's hand of it, that's Handanovic, can't even, uh, can't even get a hand on it. I'm hilarious without even trying. Este muchacho ni con la mano da una pelota bien. Es una buena ocasión en ese lugar. Again. This is the sort of thing, this is the sort of thing that Mislav Orsic allows you to do. It's the body faint, it's the dribbling. And that's left analog stick. That is peak left analog slick, left analog slick. Peak left analog stick dribbling with Mislav Orsic. If you can master left analog stick dribbling, and I almost want to put together a tutorial. He's got true 99 pace, um, about as close to true 99 pace as you can possibly have. Uh, he's got the four-star weak foot, and he might be—he might be gone. You know, we're gonna do a body. We're gonna do a techno. He might be gone. That's big. <laughs> That's where the finesse shot matters, boys. That is where the finesse shot matters. When you're in a really, really tricky situation, he's bringing his keeper out. You don't know whether to chip or not. If you have the finesse shot trait, it, you can make it a lot easier to bend the, uh, to bend the, uh, 
to bend the ball around the keeper. And uh, I mean, yeah, so 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 far, so far, Madlad Mislav, uh, so far, Madlad Mislav has lived up to expectations. What hasn't lived up to expectations, I feel like his team of the season. That's back-to-back -back Mislav Orsic Hatties. It took him eight attempts in the first match. We get we get the back-to-back -back, uh, Hattie with Mislav Orsic in match number two. Four total attempts, three goals, showcasing a little bit of that finesse, showcasing a little bit of that strength, and uh, Mislav going in obviously uh, with the hat trick. But I don't think there's a goal that exemplifies what you're able to do with Mislav Orsic more. Um, it wasn't this one. Was it this one? It might have been this one, you know? I mean, like, come on. I mean, I, I totally forgot about this one right here, but look at this. This is literally, this is what I mean when I say left analog stick dribbling, right? That's left analog stick dribbling. Do you see how fast he pulls back there? Bam. Left analog stick dribbling again to just kind of move around and then a body faint to get around, a body faint to get around PK. This is, look at it in real time. Pop. Left analog stick, stick dribbling too. Body faint around PK and blast. Literally split PK's nuts in half. This this was the one that really reminded me that Mislav Orsic has arrived. This is not what you were able to do with his previous card. Look look at how many guys we just kind of look look how many look how many dudes we just glide around. Bam! There's one. There's a body faint. There's PK again. There's Casmiro, and then there's a pop. There's really not too much more to say about Mislav or There's really not too much to say about the team of the season content in terms of upgrade packs, in terms of SBCs. Matuidi, again, selfishly, I love it because it's Inter Miami. Uh, felt pretty good in that in that final match, um, in that la in the second half of the last match. I'll probably do a more in-depth way view on him, especially uh, given the fact that we're going to run him in all 30 games of weekend league coming up in this next weekend. Uh, and then also, I'm going to try and snipe the Nani and try and do an epi on him because he looks absolutely ridiculous. He looks like he might be the best card on the day between MLS Tots and rest of the world. But Liga and Tots, man. I don't know what it is, bro. There's so many... There, 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 there's such an opportunity there to knock this one out of the park and, and salvage it. And now I'm starting to think, is Ultimate Tots kind of going to be a flop? You know what word I would like to use here? Sleepy. Team of the season just seems a little bit sleepy if I was trying to find the, if I was trying to find the right word to describe it. So uh, that's going to do it for the Mislav Orsic Epi. Again, summer vibes. I don't know. It's 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 hot. It's getting really hot in a lot of places in the world right now. And I feel like everyone's just kind of cooling off, maybe not taking ser uh, FIFA as seriously. And I think maybe now's the time when we just have a little bit of fun. If there's some fun cards that come out in terms of stats, in terms of like maybe a fun little storyline, we go ahead and we do those. But in terms of a super sub for 140,000 coins, four to five in terms of value. In terms of on the pitch performance, I'm going to give him a four to five i wanted to give him a four and a half but there are some times where he feels a little bit heavy but then there's also some times where he's able to slice through defense with the left analog stick dribbling again i think it's coming from a weekend league where we had all five star skiller and four star uh, skill move players uh coming to a guy that has three star weak foot leaves you at a little bit of a disadvantage and makes you feel like it, you're not able to be as slippy as you want to be that's going to do it for the episode of boys hopefully you guys have enjoyed i'll catch you guys on stream tonight uh i'm thinking about trying this new game called out subnautica might might not even play fifa to be honest with you might just start the game uh, might start with Fallout, guys, and then move on over to Subnautica. But, uh, yeah, boys, hopefully you guys have enjoyed. If you did, smash like on the video. If you guys are new to the channel, hit that subscribe button down below. Maybe let me know a player from MLS or um, rest of the world team of the season you guys would like an epi on. And let's pray to the gods that tomorrow, maybe Liga and team of the season starts. But anyway, my bros, hopefully you guys have enjoyed. I'll catch you guys for another one tomorrow. Till next time, my bros. Tschüss. Later. Hravatska.